हेलो फ्रेंड्स गुड मॉर्निंग वी ऑल हैव अवर माइंड एंड एवरीबडी लाइक्स टू कीप वंस माइंड राइट समटाइम्स इट्स नॉट पॉसिबल टू कीप एवरी वंस माइंड दो टाइम्स वी डोंट माइंड सो लेट्स हैव अ रीडिंग ऑफ एन इंटरेस्टिंग स्टोरी विद द टाइटल वुमन विथ अ माइंड फ्रॉम सुधा मूर्तिज वाइज एंड आदर वाइज Let's get started. Woman with a mind. My friend Nalini is a professor at a college in Bangalore, a PhD in history. She is a good teacher and an excellent wife. I had not met her for a long time, so one day I decided to visit her. She was excited to see me. She was cooking a special meal for her only son, who had returned from school. While her son was preparing for the 12th standard exams her husband Satish an engineer in a multinational company was away at work so there was enough space and time for us to talk I haven't seen you around at all Nalini what's new in life nothing i have been busy because summer is in 12th standard come on Nalini you are not appearing for the exam what you can do is help him at home but that does not mean cutting yourself off from the world nalini did not agree she was tense and worried nalini what is the problem have you finished with the construction of your house satish is looking after that you were planning to buy a new vehicle what happened yes satish is planning to buy a scooter rather than a car I soon realized that all the decisions were Satish's. Nalini, don't you have any preferences? Satish is better than me in all things. He knows the outside world and has lots of contacts, so his decisions will always be correct. I was surprised by her answer. Usually, educated working women are more confident and independent and they like to make their own decisions. The next day I was traveling to a village by bus for a change the bus was not crowded a village woman yellamma got into the bus along with me i knew her because whenever i was in her village she would bring me fresh vegetables and refused to accept money yellamma was around 35 healthy and cheerful her well oiled hair was tied in a knot and a thick black beard mangal sutra rested on her neck She also wore heavy gold ear studs, a big nose ring and uh, more than a dozen green glass bangles on each wrist. No cosmetics and no pretense. Her pleasant smile added radiance to her glowing reddish brown complexion. Yellamma and her husband Rudrappa owned a small garden in the village and that was their biggest asset. They grew and sold seasonal vegetables for a living. Amma I have to rush back to my garden today she said why are you in such a hurry isn't your husband in the garden i asked yes but still i must go because i have to take an important decision today i have to sow the seeds ideal for the next 3 months surely your husband can do that i suggested no i have to make my own decision Rudrappa is also very good and experienced but I should also give my views because not all seeds can be sown in the rainy season. I liked her confidence. Initially when I gave my opinions everyone used to laugh at me. I realized however that unless I became assertive they would not give me any chance to make decisions. Without making decisions I would not gain experience. So I started sowing vegetable seeds in one corner of the garden. Neither my mother-in-law nor my husband knew that place and I experimented. The first few times they failed but I did not give up. Eventually I learned which vegetables grew in which season. Today they respect my ideas and ask me to decide. This year I want to plant carrots and cauliflower. I'm sure that the yield will be good and fetch good money. Though uneducated and unbred, Yellamma was so different from Nalini. Indeed, the story makes us to think about: Is mere education is an index of being 
सेल्फ ओपिनियनेटेड और बींग डिटर्मिंट और बींग एक्चुअली वोकल टू आवर ओन थाट्स एंड एक्शंस वी हैव टू सीरियसली थिंक ऑन बिकॉज बींग डिसिव बींग असर्टिव एड्स टू द ब्यूटी ऑफ योर पर्सनैलिटी एवरी वुमन शुड हैव देयर ओन आइडेंटिटी देयर ओन डिसीजन्स एंड देयर ओन चॉइसिस दैट्स द रियल ऑर्नामेंट दैट वन कैन वेयर ऑन थैंक यू सो मच होप यू ऑल हैव your mind always on stay connected see you in the next video till then bye bye